Welcome, welcome, welcome. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. <laughs> How are you doing today, sir?
Oh, Sar, thank you so much for the gift sub. That was kind of out of the blue. Uh, what a wonderful gift. Thank you so much. <laughs> Don't mind me. Just doing some final preparations before we get started. And maybe a little bit distracted. Just a bit, though. And you send it to Sleep Hazard too. Thank you very, very much for helping Sleep Hazard to not have to deal with subs. Much appreciated. Better blow my nose before we start, because it's kind of stuffy again. All right, let's get started. Sorry for the wait, everyone. Just gonna choke myself a little bit here. Ow. Ow. That hurt a lot more than it needed to. Move this stuff out of my ears. We're good to go. What does system crash do? That is a secret to everyone. But you're welcome to try and crash my system. Uh, once, once we get started, because uh, obviously you'll need to be able to see my models in order for that to work. And I don't want you to waste your points needlessly. Who goes there? Aeson, welcome back. Long time no see. Well, I guess not too long. Thank you very much for the gift sub as well. Always appreciated. How are you doing? Do -do -do. Hello and welcome to the Lost Time Show, everyone. Oh. Why did you redeem System Crash before I... Oh, that's weird. It's not doing anything. Let me check the reward system really quick.
That's weird. Uh, superior system crash has failed to has failed to activate. Um. No. Uh. We need to figure out what's going on. We need to figure figure this out. Since that is a very expensive selection, and it should be no. Nope. What just happened? Why does my head hurt so much? No, I uh, I actually manually pushed the button because it didn't. <laughs> oh my god. This must be what it's like to have multiple cranial fractures. It was just due to you not being unseen? Maybe. Uh, I think the effects of the system of the first system crash are still working or still activating because my model is glitching the fuck out right now. Like, like seriously, look at this. I, I, I don't feel right. I feel, I feel, I don't feel like my, I'm like myself. I don't know what you did to me. I don't know how long this is going to last. <laughs> Mommy, I'm scared. <laughs> Shit. You call this a feature? <laughs> it's a hell of a feature. That's for damn sure. For real, for real. I blame all of y'all for this the current state of things. I hope y'all happy now. For this madness. This is all thanks to your efforts. The combined efforts over 8,000 meme points. Non-fuckable tokens. I have a bad- I have a feeling like I'm gonna be stuck like this the entire stream now. It's time to mix lives and change drinks. You bet your ass it is. You know what, let's just go ahead like this. Fuck it. Fuck it, we're, we're doing it live. Oh my god, these allergies are something else, aren't they? I'm glad System Crash still works. It just took some finagling to activate. Alright then. It's time to mix drinks and say and, and maim some lives, chap. The electricity bill will be sent out on the 24th. Please make sure you have over 8 grand needed. Jill is feeling down, but she really liked the cutesy game poster she saw. Buying it will prevent her from getting too distracted. Oh, it looks like we're back to normal now. Well, as normal as normal can be, given the circumstances. Now, chap, you may y'all may recall that last stream was kind of a serious time, a serious ending to a serious game. Out, thank you for throwing something at my face, Takuro. Uh, apparently twice now you've done that. I love how much my chat loves. You. I'm really feeling the love tonight. <laughs> you want Dorothy to hug you? I can be your Dorothy. <laughs> so let's buy a poster chat. Let me make sure she really liked that cutesy game poster she saw. Thankfully, it's fairly cheap, it looks like. Aw, oh, it is a cute poster. Man, Jill is depressed, but then again, I can't blame her. She did just get bitched out by the uh, younger sister of her ex. 
How tall am I? Uh, the host is around five feet seven inches tall. I myself can be any height or any any height that I wish. Height has no meaning to an artificial intelligence. <laughs> so no, long time no see. How are you doing tonight? Hmm. Twink mat for real for real. <laughs> You need to find out if I'm twink material or not. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Sonu. How long or have you been? At finals at 5 p.m.? Oh, well, good luck on your finals. Thank you for stopping by. Aw, I miss you too, Sonu. Have you been? Been busy? Good busy? That's good to hear. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Sometimes one of the best things you can do is to be busy, I suppose. <laughs> oh boy, chat. Uh, what new things have been released in Danger U? Maquis releasing the EKD... Is this the greatest thing? Is this the greatest thing to ever grace planet Earth? I literally cannot stop touching myself. Such high quality release. But why is the camo blurry? I think it's a regulation for the civilian models. Something's off. I'd be all over this normally, but I can't seem to get excited over this. Your shit taste is showing. Nah, I just think I'm kind of de 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 I'm kind of tired of the same thing over and over. Seeing this you thread? You're now the secret secretary of Funny School Club and tutor on weekends? Oh, very nice, very nice. You're really making- you're really- Ow, thank you for the Hydra Redeem, Vimboy. You're really making your way up in the world, aren't you? The CNSU thread, except with fewer Russians. Indeed. Watered lulls. I'm a little plant, short and stout. Thank you for the gamer pride, Vemboy. Ah! Thank you for the headpad as well. Oh man, imagine having sun. Couldn't be me. I actually brought the I actually had the host bring the plants back outside because it's not scheduled to freeze over for again for a little bit. Hopefully. This has been a very cold spring for the United States. Y'all missed it. Uh, we actually had three system crashes uh, redeemed on stream. Much to my chagrin. I will have temporary brain damage for the next three months because of it. But you too can extend my brain damage by redeeming even more system crashes. We should actually get a counter of how many, get a counter or something of how many times system crash has been redeemed. You know, just for the memes. Imagine living in a seasonal place. I know, right? We have all four seasons in this country, and the Midwest has all four seasons at once. We have one season, huh? Wet and dry. Painful. We have wet and dry. Now. <laughs> Io? Jinx? That's what happens when you consume way too much fucking military equipment and weapons. Yeah, I think it's that. I better stop buying so many weapons already or I'll never find pleasure in them again. Any word on the camo stuff for other civilian weaponry? They said they were going to announce more stuff on a later date. I like porn, you guys. I too greatly enjoy porn. Damn, deep southern tropics. We just have hot or less hot. <laughs> Oh, uh, that is certainly a description of all time. I think we already read these last week. Yeah, we already read these last week. Let's see what's new. 
articles with the augmented eye. Kira Miki's Encore Concert, Ayo. Give me a Toho themed Glock. <laughs> Why don't you make it Toho themed Glock? Why do you get Glock when you can get cock? And ball torture? Hey, if you're providing, I will disseminate the torture. Y'all can have as much cock as you want, though. Fans of the famous cyber idol Kira Miki are in for a huge party, all thanks to the announcement of a second concert in Glitch City's Silver Thunder Superdome. I'm so excited to extend my visit, declared the cyber idol during an interview. Tickets are now up for sale and expected to disappear in a matter of minutes, so be quick and secure the best spots. You can get tickets from the following retailers. Ticket Lord, Idol Hell. Sim, swear to God, swear to God. Dugsdale Dimidome. Indeed, indeed, indeed. New act proposes increased surveillance. We have nanomachines tracking people 24-7. However, due to the violent protests that have taken place recently, Prime Minister Quincy is now proposing a new law that will allow the government to shut down anyone with nanomachines in their body using a pulse signal. Many people died during the protests, and that could have been avoided if we had more control over the masses, Quincy said during a parliament meeting. We have the technology to simply shut down lawbreakers. It's a non-lethal way to end any kind of conflict, and it's common sense to use it at this point. When asked about the possible negative consequences, Quincy refused to make any further comments. Did we already read this last time? We probably didn't. Average authoritarian? Dictator, rather? Indeed. Literally 1984. Literally 1984. Alright then, chat. Um, I think we will have enough money to pay off electricity bill by the 24th, maybe? The Vikings are coming. We can... I'll tell you something that's coming. Coming soon to a theater near you. Conquer you, baby. If I have permission, sure. <laughs> Good evening. Are you okay? I feel like shit. Now, that is certainly a mood of all time. You sure you should have come then? You're in all the right, you're in all the right to stay at home. I have to come. I threw away everything I had in my life to be here. People I loved were pushed aside just so I could enjoy my freedom of being here. My stupid, stupid freedom. So, I will come here until I die. Even after the bar closes, until my hair falls out. Damn. You're the one who looks like she's about to fall apart. Your eyes are red and swollen. Yeah? Well, your hair is... hairy. That's a lot of hair to fall. Hair fall kind of sounds like either a musical or a thriller movie. Yes, it is. <laughs> Who was the dipshit that changed the order of the glasses? It was me. I was the one washing dishes yesterday, remember? Oh, yeah, I was too busy staring at my crumbling life and all that. Why don't you go home, Jill? You're in no position to deal with people right now. Go home, rest a bit. My girlfriend... My ex-girlfriend died and I wasn't there to see her one last time. All because of a fight I spent all these years regretting and wishing to but never actually apologizing for. My decision to assert my freedom and grab a hold of my life led me to this. A bartender is trapped for cash that distanced herself from her loved ones for no other reason than selfishness. So I won't fucking leave. I threw all of that away to be here, so here I will stay. 
This is what I wanted. This is why I left all that behind. And this is why... See? You're starting to sound like a broken record. Oh, leave her be. I'd rather have her here than be alone in her apartment. How are you feeling, Jill? I feel like a shit-eating piece of shit. I'm the lowest of any possible life form you might find. Nanobees look down to me in disgust, knowing they're far superior. You're spirited, that's good. Where's the mutt? Working with Sira. At Sira. I know what I said. In any case, let Jill process her anger. It's perfectly normal to feel that like, feel way. And here, she's surrounded by people that care about her. That's actually v so wholesome. <laughs> Who's the dipshit to the face of the dipshit? She needs more boss hugs. Shitty shit cannibalism. Indeed, it's a eat. It's a shit eat shit world out there. And we have to clean it up. That's a lot better than leaving her to fend for herself. I mean, as smart as four might be, he's still just a cat. Then why not have Jill stay, but not serve anyone today? What part of I won't leave didn't you understand? Had to silence my phone for a bit there. I didn't leave everyone behind to just sit around and do nothing. Fine, fine. What do we do if she lashes out at a client? That's why you're here, Gillian Pliskin. Who? Hey, Jill. What? I'll be in my office, but if you need a break or a hug, just tell me. Alright, chat. Time for you to choose what music we're playing to ch during tonight's stream. Boss hugs, indeed. The Akira reference one? Um, which one is that? Digital drive? Good for health, but bad for education? Okay. Fake weeb, fake weeb. Damn right I have fake weeb. And not only am I fake weeb, I'm a fake millennial too. Not even watching Akira shaking my head, shaking my head. Some VTuber I turned out to be. <laughs> what else should we uh, listen to? A gaze that invited despair? That's true. I am thousands of years old. Bloody Karma, welcome to the stream! How are you doing tonight? Oh, gay is an X? Okay. Well, I already got- I already put a gaze that invited, so... Then Neon? Then Troubling News? Gonna go focus on lunch? Have fun with Vahela? Well, thank you, Sonu. You have a good rest of your day. Good luck on your exams. Bye-bye-bye-bye. Bye 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 Drive you wild? You want me to drive you wild, Io? Who was I? Uh. Give me more, BB. I miss you. <laughs> I'll do my best to. <laughs> All right. So we've already chosen half of the songs. If anyone else has any song requests, uh, feel free to drop them in chat. These will be played throughout the entirety of tonight's playthrough of Valhalla. You're done with your half? Okay, no problem. Let me choose mine then. Thank you. 
Here we go. Oh, you already put on music. Sorry, this is going to be an interesting day. The Hall of Heroes keeps shining, brimming with the... Do I smell tacos? Wait, it's outside. Never mind. Oh, hell no. We meet again, bartender! Virgilio, what can I get you? Today, the luminous pollution on the streets makes it seem almost like a starry sky! And when I think about stars, I think about celebrities. Celebrities are fishy, and my favorite fish is the octopus. So I want something octopus-like. Aren't you gonna do that weird bartending thing? I'm waiting for you to order like a decent human being. I'm not following. Spell out your order like you're a human who is not in need of medical help. Fine, then. I want a sparkle star. S-P-A-R-R-C-L star. Fuck. Sparkling. Sparkling stars. Ah. I'm pretty sure he means send star, though. However, I just want to make sure, because Virgilio likes to be a sneaky bastard. And I refuse to lose a perfect run because of his stupidity. Oh. I'm actually kind of fucking dumb. There is, in fact, a Sparkle Star. Good thing I checked first. I thought- I didn't know Sparkle Star was a thing. I thought he wanted a Zen Star. Also, holy shit, it is loud. Like, I actually- I'm actually having a hard time hearing myself think. I need to- I need to reduce the loudness of the... Okay. Okay, thank God. My my ears are actually starting to hurt. It was actually that loud shit. So, they won a Sparkle Star. Two Aldehydes, one Powder Delta, and... H... An optional Carmotrine. See? Was that, a dot? Was that that hard? Have you tried to spell under pressure? You look angry, spelling bartender. Are you having that time of the month or something? Holy fuck, Virgilio is gonna get punched in the face yet. No, I'm just filled with ridiculous amounts of anger, pain, and self-hate, and... On second thought, you're not that far from the truth, I guess. I get those too, you know. Periods. You do? Yes! Last month, I finally got over my renaissance and moved to my enlightenment. <laughs> oh man, I'll pile- he's gonna get a pile driver alright. Or a bad touch, for that matter. And here I was, thinking you'd get to say something serious for once. Are you implying that I'm not serious? Glaring holes through me will do nothing. I'm glare immune! <sighs> but 
if you allow me to give you a sincere piece of advice... Whatever, it's not like it'll, not like it'll help. You shouldn't kick yourself so much. If you keep it up, any chance of finally forgiving yourself will someday be gone. Self-hate will leave you with a hole that will never heal. So please, take measures against it instead of sulking so much. Well, I'll be damned. You actually sounded half sensible. And here I was thinking you were just a pompous lunatic. Hey! Pompous lunatics have stories too! Really? What story? I... Uh, would rather not tell. Figures. You want anything else? Have you ever seen how the... A bad touch. Bad touch, whatever. God, chap. You know that Jill is in a bad mood because she did not laugh at the bad touch joke. Damn. Looks like I need to put another a new goal over here on uh, Twitch because we had just reached our most recent goal of 500 followers. In fact, we're at 501 today, chap. It's been a while since I've done any uh, milestone redeems, so I honestly don't know what to do for this. I should probably do another community challenge. But the question is, what should the community challenge be? I don't know, actually. My followers seem to be very much into torture porn. So, you know. Anyway, let's give him a bad touch. Two Bronson Extract. Two Powder Delta. Two Flannery Guides. Four Karma Trains. All on the rocks and mixed. Here. Yeah, I guess this is the one. Maybe he's right and I shouldn't be so hard on myself. Even though I deserve every second of it. If only I had apologized earlier, I might not be feeling this way right now. If only I... If only I... I can't even remember what held me from apologizing all these years. Um, bartender. You're making a lot of faces there. Pride? Fear? What kept me from going out and apologizing to Lenore? Can't even fucking remember what feeling kept me from fixing this whole situation. Can't I at least find solace in whatever feeling it was that brought me to the situation? Great. Now I'm feeling even worse thanks to not being able to muster whatever feeling held me. Is she okay? No, but just leave her be for now. Hey, Jill! Eh? Oh, thank God, a normal person. Wow, mommy! No, 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 I don't have kids. I fucking love Say so much. Yeah, it's almost like you have a Virgilo Gar. Virgilo Dar or something. Still more normal than this twat. How are you feeling, Say? My bones are still broken, but at least the cuts are healing nicely. Thank God I'm not someone that scars easily. Um, I mean, wounds don't leave me marks. It'd be a problem if I couldn't get scar tissue. What happened to you? Fell off two and a half stories into some trash and rumble. You look better, though. Last time you came, you looked like you were about to collapse emotionally. <laughs> I guess. You're the one that looks like it now, though. How do I put it? It's like when I called you your full name, but magnified. Yeah, don't mind me too much. I'm in a bad mood. Anything I can do? Please forgive me if I suddenly lash out at you or anyone else. Winter, thank you so much for the sub and welcome to today's stream. 12 years. Hell yeah! Woo! It's hard to believe that we've known each other for more for over a year. And that I've been streaming for more than a year. Actually, I'm... I mean... Honestly, well, I kind of 
gone over this several times now, haven't I? There are many chances. I had many chances to quit streaming, but I didn't. And I managed to hold on to a very loyal following, to whom I am eternally grateful for my regulars. And I'm glad I can continue to entertain you to this very day. We reached our follower goal of 500 followers earlier today. In fact, we have 501 followers now. I do not know what to do for celebration, but if any of you have any suggestions, I am all ears. I'm open to pretty much anything that is within Twitch's Terms of Service. And if there's anything that isn't on Twitch's Terms of Service, we can discuss that in private on Discord. Anyway, um, so, uh, yeah, um, if y'all have any ideas for what to do to celebrate that, uh, feel free to let me know wherever you have what means of contacting me. Hell... I wouldn't even mind uh, taking the time to commission some artwork, possibly. I certainly have the funds to do so now, which is not something that I thought I would ever get to say again. Ayo? Yes. Yes. Yes, you heard that right. You know what? Um... I should probably make that like a poll on Twitter and also on uh, VT, VT Social and also on Discord. So if y'all have any ideas for how we should celebrate reaching 500 followers, literally just throw it anywhere here in chat or on Discord or on Twitter, wherever. My mods and I will collect all the responses and we will make a poll and post it everywhere. And yes, it could be literally anything. Although, as usual, we have final say on what actually gets to be put on the uh, poll. But I trust y'all a decent amount. I'm fairly sure that none of you will suggest anything to Sussy Bucka. Also, I apologize if my voice sounds a little bit strange. I do have a stuffy nose. The allergies are hitting like, a, like an Isekai truck right now. Which is... Unfortunately, certainly a thing of all time. Oh, thank you for the headpats. Don't worry, nobody will outsource me for suggestions. Really? I would love to see between you and Vemboy and pretty much the rest of our uh, little club of Danger U, seeing who could outsuss each other. All right. Uh, Jill, do you want something? My tongue's not so sensitive today, so let's have a beer. And you? Such a change in tone. Uh, I'm fine. I don't need anything. Let's make a beer. A big beer. Here. Yay! Let's see if there are any differences from the canned ones. And? This one tastes less watered down. So did something happen to you? I'm fine. Nothing's happened to me. People who are fine don't act like that. Oh, I get it. You're in those days. When it's that time of the month, I get a bit sulky. No, I'm I'm not on my period. No? I'm dealing with the loss of someone, okay? Oh. Sorry. Don't worry. Maybe I shouldn't have come in today, after all. Hi! Gavin, welcome to the stream! Thank you so much for the 12-person raid! Welcome, welcome, welcome! Welcome, 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 welcome. Can we get a shout out for Gavin the 11th? Gavin XI, Gavin 11. Welcome to the stream. Oh, you were playing Faster Than Lights? That is a great game. I have not played a game in forever. Oh, uh, Raiders, welcome to the Lost Time Show. My name is Lawler Hicks. I'm a shitposter AI. I am cyberpunk flavored. 
I am currently on the run from the internet feds. I may or may not be blackmailing a fleshy humanoid into collecting money for me for the Get Lawler a Real Body Fund. Glad you could join us. We are actually playing a game that's based in my hometown, the hometown of Glitch City in the year 2070X, which is actually 2072. That's right, we are playing a Cyberpunk Bartender Simulator. It is VA11 Hall A, but we like to call it Valhalla. We haven't either. We did poorly. Oh, that's all right. Everyone does poorly in FTL. It'll take you a good 20, maybe 20 or more hours before you get good enough at that game to actually win it. The first time I won in FTL, I actually died at the same time. And I didn't win again for like a couple games. I think it's easier now though. Or maybe it's harder now? I don't know. It's been a while. I love sending viewers to Valhalla streams. Comfy post stream. Well, I'm glad you think so. Thank you so much for considering my stream. Um, so yeah, I'm Lawler Hicks. I'm a ship poster AI. Most of my content uh, is, a var is variety content. However, a lot of it is cyberpunk flavored. On Mondays, I like to play indie cyber. I like to play indie games. We are currently making our way through VA11 Hall A. On Wednesdays, I like playing a lot of uh, a lot of cyberpunk games and a lot of um, older FPS games. In this case, I'm currently playing Deus Ex. And on Fridays, I like to reserve for fighting games, which is my second greatest love. This Friday, I actually have a fighting game tournament. The VTuber fighting game community is having another Guild to Gear Strive. Uh, tourney, which I'll be joining. And on Saturdays, I like to have writing streams. I'm actually a creative writer, and my host, the person running the stream right now, uh, is a graduate with a bachelor's in journalism. So that was their great love before they were not able to get employed in it. And so they do it on the side. We're a competitive FGC stream. Oh, lol, we're huge into the fighting game community and my community. We're a competitive FGC variety stream. Oh, very good, very good. Are you in the uh, VFGC Discord already? If not, I can give you a Discord link. I would love to see you around. We're always uh, looking for new people or new VTubers to, uh, or even just, you, even, you don't really need to be a VTuber to join the community. If you like to find people to play with, well, there's always people to play with there. And also, I have to ask, uh, what kind of fighting games do you like to play? Guilty Gear and Melty at the moment? But long history? Good choices. A streamer after my own heart. <laughs> well, yeah, um, so... That's pretty much my spiel. Still a work in progress, but uh, I hope that gives a decent overview of my content. Of my content, uh, feel free to stick around and watch me uh, watch me portray these characters with terrible voice acting and a little bit of schizophrenia to boot. If y'all decide that you want to stick around, I would really appreciate a follow. We actually just reached 500 followers today. So I was inviting my community to uh, list suggestions for what they would like me to do as in celebration of 500 viewers on Twitch. I am open to pretty much everything. And I, yes, I, or almost everything, of course, within reason. And without further ado, once again, Gavin, thank you so much for the raid. And we're going to go ahead and continue our playthrough of VA11 Hall A. Congrats, cool milestone. Oh, thank you so much, Rimpent. Yes, indeed. It's a big one, honestly. After I went on hi hiatus back on January, I was kind of afraid that I had stalled myself for a while, but as soon as we got back, we were able to get back in it pretty quick. I couldn't have done it without this the great community that I had to begin with. And we just keep on growing. Dude, dude. Do, 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 do. Um, no, I, um, hmm, maybe. Ah, are you all right? I'm trying to find something to say. 
Making a joke would be tasteless, and I can't say everything would be alright without sounding cheap. I'm at a loss of what to do here, I'm sorry. <laughs> Wanna hear something weird? I was exactly like that when Stella came here on Monday talking about you. Oh. Well, ladies, I'm leaving. Virgilio? Yeah? You were just sitting with a Valkyrie. Really? Splendid. This will make a good entry in my poems blog. I feel I feel bad about the way I treated him today. If not for the fact that he was being cryptic with his orders for no good reason. Like Stella when she first came? Yes. No, I mean... <laughs> you could have given him a free beer or something and apologized. Yeah, I just keep messing things up with people. But you know, he seems familiar. Familiar? Yeah, I can't put my finger on it though. I just feel like I've seen him somewhere before. Oh well. It might just be that he looks like someone from an ad or something. So, what brings you here, here today? I wanted to come with Stella, so I'm waiting for her. Why here? To be with you, of course. Say is so... just... God. I love Say. Say is best girl. That reminds me, how did Stella react when you arrived? She slapped me real hard. It hurt. She said, that's for making me worried and not listening to me. And then she became happy. Huh. Can I ask whose loss you're dealing with? You shouldn't be bothered with it. Just pretend we're in a bad mood and call it a day. Oh. Okay. You really want to know, huh? I can't help it. I don't like seeing people sad. I just need to know context, not details. Someone to whom I said I could mean... Someone to whom I said some mean things to passed away before I could ever see her again. Does that work? Yeah, sorry. Knowing I can't do anything helps me calm down, but... Uh, I mean... It's not that I couldn't... Wouldn't help, I just... Calm down. I get it. I can't contain myself when I see people in need. But I've learned that there are times when you just can't do anything, and that's kind of fine. Thank God I learned that, otherwise I would have gone insane ages ago. You're a good person, say. Nah, I'm just an annoying girl. Still, if there's anything I can do to help, let me know. I have broken bones, but it doesn't mean I can't offer emotional support. You could always order another drink. Oh yeah, that. So let's do that. Give me something cold, please. All right. Let's give something say with ice. Let's say, let's give say something with ice. I'm pretty sure say enjoys cobalt velvets, but let me make sure. Oh. I guess it doesn't really matter as long as it's cold, huh? Well, I thought a cobalt velvet first, so let's give her a cobalt velvet. All in the rocks and mixed. It's like champagne served in a cup that had a bit of cola left. A large cobalt velvet. Here. It's pretty cold outside though. Yeah, but I don't like hot or warm drinks. They make me feel nauseous. You know what cheers me up? What? Singing. Hearing people sing helps me. It helps too. Do you sing? 
I mean, did you take singing lessons or something? Nope. People have told me my voice is pretty nasty, actually. But they've also told me I'm good with the harmonica. So you played a harmonica. I need something to do some breathing exercises with, and a harmonica is a, lo a lot smaller than a tuba. And I guess if you practice enough, you become decent. That's something I didn't expect. I hear that a lot. I don't know, like, I don't... I know... I know I don't look like the musical type. I used to play the violin. Right until I was 16 or so. Really? Can you still play? The violin's at my mom's house, so I don't have it with me. Excuse me, chap. Whew, that kind of felt nasty. But I guess I could. It's one of those things you don't forget easily. And why did you stop? I don't know. One day I just felt like stopping. No deep reason behind it. Just like me and cooking. That, and almost burning my place up. <laughs> oh, say. When's Stella coming? Now that you mention it, she's a bit late. Let me call her. You do that. I'm gonna go take my break. Tell Gil if you need anything else. Sure. And with that chat, we're gonna take a short break. We're gonna say we shall reconvene in about five minutes or so. Starting right about now.
Thank you for the head pads, Finboy. Just refilled my water glass and uh, did my Duolingo. <laughs> Going back live in. And we're back. Hopefully, voice should sound a little bit better now. Not sure. The problem with allergies is that you will have to blow your nose eventually again in the near future. Hopefully not tonight. But you never know, really. Anyway, let us continue. Ah, my thumbs hurt now. Complain the Kalimba would recently cut thumb thumbnails. What a paradox. It is now safe to keep playing. Still don't say make me a bit jealous. You don't say. Back. Looks like you've calmed down. I still feel like kicking myself, make no mistake. But I guess I cool down a bit. Say helped a lot with that one though. I just can't stay mad when I see her. Speaking of which, where is she? I believe she went outside to look for that Stella girl or something. The way you are right now, it looks like it feels like I should be protecting you. Hey, the only thing hindering me is the broken arm. I got into burning buildings with a two centimeter deep cut. Yeah, I remember that one. One millimeter more and you would have lost the motor function in your arm. Welcome. Ah, it's our two lovebirds chat. Ah, hello Jill. What's this about protecting who? Yeah, um, I'm sort of like Stella's unofficial bodyguard, but I'm not really fit for such duties right now. My father insists I go everywhere with protection, so most of the time, I only ask Say if she feels like going out. She's trained to deal with the kind of things that bodyguards deal with anyway. And she's more fun to hang around with, too. So I'm assuming that gorilla outside is a bodyguard? That's Buster, pretty cool guy. He played football professionally until he lost his leg in a demolition derby. We've offered him an implant surgery for all his use of service, but he rejects it every time. Well, he got used to the replacement he's using, so maybe it's for the best. It's a thick oak branch on, on a metal bowl tied to his stump. And yet, he can still run faster than me with it. True. Do you want something? I'm fine right now. A Brantini. A big one. I'm in a good mood. One big Brantini for Stella.
I fucked it up. There we go. Much better. Ah, there we go. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. A large Brantini coming right up here. After all these years, I still don't get it why the finest and most expensive things come in small packages. Ever tried to go to a restaurant only for them to serve you a really small portion of some fine food? Sometimes you just want to stuff yourself with really cheap food. Now that is certainly a mood of all time. Say, let's go for some hamburgers later. I'm not taking a no for an answer. I know what you mean when you say some, you know? Might as well call the place and tell them to prepare everything in advance. Can I ask you to do something? I love say too. Sure. I guess. How did you two meet? Stella showed up in the park I used to play at when I was a kid. We played a couple of times. She started showing up more and more and more and that was it. <clears throat> My father told me that when I was five, I kept insisting on going to a real kid's park. We drove for some time and the park I liked was the one Say happened to be at. Have you ever seen a girl in a dress go to a muddy park? She learned her lesson and started showing up with more fitting clothes. But man, that's a scene I can't forget. Headpats in the chat for Stella. I love Say. Stella is starting to grow on me too, though. So you two have known each other for most of your lives? I've known her longer than I've known my own father. What? Why the question? No reason. You two just look so comfortable with each other. Any other person could have sworn you were an item. An item? What kind of item? A couple, say. Oh, it's a... Yeah, I get it now. It's funny because we actually earned a mock prize of sorts for best couple at Stella's high school. Three years in a row. So you two didn't go to the same high school? Nope. Oh. Don't you have any childhood friends, Jill? Childhood friends. Can't think of any. My grandpa, I guess. What kind of man was he? Gruff? The kind to eat raw Bronson roots every morning? Brrr. But around me, he was different. I have memories of him breaking orders to my, barking orders to my dad, only to turn around and play with me gently. It's interesting, though. He was my mom's dad. But after my mom and dad separated, he stayed with my dad. But yeah, he's the one that comes to mind when I think about childhood friends. Ooh... Hey Jill, what's this bloom light? A spicy drink, tastes nice at first time, but it gets samey after a while. It's also brown for some reason. Give me one of those, please. I'll have one too. On it. Two bloom lights for the girls. Playing this game makes me want to make a cocktail myself, but I need to lay off the alcoholic beverages. Here. I don't know, I kind of like it. Yeah, but after the third one, it starts tasting like sand. Spicy sand, but sand nonetheless. Who's... <gasps> Dimming the light. Zzz. Huh, I guess she had too much before I came. Well, that and she must still be tired. From the whole bank thing? I hate sand as well. Oh my god, it's coarse, it's rough and irritating. Oh my fucking god, of course you would quote, <laughs> quote that. And it gets everywhere. Do you know what also gets everywhere? 
If you guess copies of Lawler Hicks, actual ship poster AI, and possibly possible malware, then you guessed right, chat. She told me about everything that happened in there. To be honest, I don't think I would have made it in her place. I guess I should be thankful for the nanomachine treatment she went through as a white knight. Treatment? Trauma suppressors. Basically, it helps with the healing process of PTSD. It's mandatory for every white knight, regardless of division. Oh. Still, healing can only do so much. For three days, that bank was hell, and poor Say was still paying for it. The disbanding of the white knights and subsequent persecution of those who identified as former members. It's unfair, you know? Among all the people using the white knights to further their own goals. Say was one of the few that actually believed in what they are supposed to do. It's paid off, though. The doctor who treated her wounds was the same one she's always assisted with accidents and emergencies. He treated her at no cost whatsoever. Well, good karma and all that. She's earned the God's favor, I think. But you know, all of that made me realize I might be a bad person. How? When I saw Say wounded asking for help, a part of me was happy. Bruh. After all this time needing her, she finally needed me. I felt truly useful to her for the first time. How sad is that? Sometimes the best help one can provide is to stay alive. Who knows? Maybe it was the idea of coming back to you that helped her. And I guess you wouldn't be human without thoughts like those in once in a while. Maybe. Can I get you anything else? I'm good. I should be leaving, actually. Come, say. Let's get hamburgers and go home. Mm, yeah. We'll be leaving now. Thank you. Please come again. Feeling better? No, I just don't reek of rage. But I still feel like a piece of shit. Little steps, I guess. Uh, hello? Ah, Kim. Welcome. I was afraid I'd mix up the directions and end up in someone's house or something. I haven't seen Kim in a long time. What can I get you? I'll have a sunshine cloud, please. Sure. Here. Thanks. So, how's work on the web paper? Oh, I quit. What? Yep, I went to the office of that chauvinistic horn blower, horse blower and I told him I quit. Why did you do that? I arrived early to my meeting and got some assignment. I spent hours doing it only for the other bitches to come and ruin it. After that, I didn't have time left so my supervisor scolded me. So I snapped and quit on a whim. Oh. Don't you have any second thoughts? Regret anything? I guess you'll always have second thoughts. Even if you do what you want, you'll still think, what if? Even so, I was getting physically sick there. I dread the arrival of every morning. I even almost... What I'm saying is, I don't know what I'll do, but it's certainly better than being there. I feel... free. Free? It's a wonderful feeling, you know. I feel like I can now, I, I feel like now I can find something I care about. I won't return to the augmented eye, but I could still pursue journalism with much or with another outlet. I haven't felt like this in, well, never. Kim's hitting different than what she did when she, when you played? Well, you did play this, like, years ago, so maybe you're just interpreting it differently. Now. Ahem. What about your family? They weren't happy, that's for sure. My dad took it better, but my mom freaked out, to put it mildly. I didn't relate as much as you do now. <laughs> now that is a mood, isn't it? The key to sympathy, after all, is to experience what someone else's experience, or to imagine yourself in someone else's position. Sometimes that's hard to do. 
unless you physically have been there yourself. For the record, I too know what it's like to be in Kim's position. My first job was fucking bullshit. Ah. What are you gonna do and all that? But I'm not here about that. Give me a big drink, please. What kind? I don't know. Bubbly or something. Something big and bubbly, huh? I'll give her something big and bubbly. Here. If detergent commercials are to be believed, this will clean out my insides. It'll also kill things inside you. I gotta ask though, how did you end up working there? I need to check something really quick. deep reason. That's what I did when I got out of high school. Taking a year off was out of the question. So I went for the first thing I thought about. But I couldn't get into the robotics course, so I settled for journalism. To be honest, I got tired of the job midway through it, but I couldn't bring myself to leave. Too much pressure from my family. It's a really common tale, I guess. Did you have troubles like this? Same story as you. I just went through the motions. From high school to college, I never stopped to think about what it was that I was doing. And then at some point, I just felt like my life slipped through my fingers. Suddenly, all I wanted was freedom, a little pause. To stop and take a breather. And my life went to hell for that fucking breather. Yeah, um, give me a... something. Something? Sorry, I just have a dry mouth. Anything will do. Alright. I'll give her something, alright. Apparently, if I want to trigger the secret guests, now is the time to serve her a drink for the trigger. So I need to serve her something that is not in the menu, which I'm going to do now. Incidentally, I actually have the other game that has the secret recipe for this particular drink. Um, 2069? Is it 2069 or 2064? It's probably 2064. We could probably play that later. It's probably a decent idea considering it's, a independent, it's an indie game that's also a cyberpunk game. 2048. Thank you. So, we'll play that in the future. Ta-da! 2060... So it is 2069? I was right the first time? Here. Thanks. 
I feel like I asked something I shouldn't have. I see. So I'll only be able to unlock one of the secret clients because in order to unlock the rest, I would have had to do it at the very beginning of the game. And I did not think to do that, so we're not going to be able to get all the secret clients this run, chat. That's alright. At least we have one out of three. A block sliding game? Never heard of it. I feel like I have asked something I shouldn't have. Don't fret about it. I'm just in a rough spot right now. What are you going to do now? Honestly, I don't know. I do feel liberated, however. Like, I can do whatever I want. Study whatever I like, work wherever I want. I know it's not that way and it won't be easy, but... I feel a lot more confident than when I was out of high school. I honestly... Don't get why they put young people who barely know how the society works through that one. Well, I wish you the best of luck. Your mental health should be your priority and all that. Thanks, I really needed the encouragement. Come back if you need more encouragement. I wouldn't dare leave someone alone when it comes to that sort of thing. Thanks, bye Jill. Please come again. <sighs> you should take some of that advice for yourself. I know, I know. Let's call it a day for now. You need some rest. Yeah. Honey! Ah, Dorothy, sorry, we're just closing. I know, I came for you. For me? Why are you hugging me? I paid her to do that. All night long. Come again? To put it simply, Dorothy will go home with you and she won't leave your side. Io? Dana paid for us to have a prostitute this evening? I want that. Me too. What do you hope to accomplish with that? Well, at first it was to calm that rage you had earlier. It was either hugs or a cold bucket. And I don't promise there will be any water in it. You calm down a bit, but honestly, I know better than to leave you alone for another night. At the very least, all that cuddling will give you an epiphany or something. That's some alien reasoning right there. It's not. You need hugs. Many hugs. You need some human or er, humanoid contact right now. You had your alone time. Now we're playing by my rules. Please take care of me. There you go. Buy something nice for you and Dorothy. I you? Excellent. We have one more day until our electricity bill is due. Something tells me we're going to make it, chap. Jill wants to get in the holiday mood. Buying a mega Christmas tree will prevent her from getting too distracted. We need to pay to have genuine human connection. Capitalism and its consequences have been a disaster for mankind. And Lilum kind, for that matter. Who was that Lilum? A very good friend. <sighs> I 
Mm. There we go. Much better. Don't mind me. Just messing around with my camera settings. I'll generate a gi uh, your gino join a connection, whatever the fuck I'm trying to say. But halfway through the stream, sounds to me like we can either uh, play a different game, or we can play another day of Valhalla. It's up to y'all. What do y'all want me to do tonight? Mega Christmas. Damn, these things are expensive. Good thing I have a lot of money. I have a decent amount of money. That's a cute tree. What new posts do we have on Danger U this evening? Monster Girlfriend Chirari. Can't stop playing this game. Gorgeous graphics, innovative and addictive battle system, fun dating minigames, cute girls, that fucking music. Is this the goat? Dunno, do you like the goat girl? Heh, <laughs> I'm gonna marry a goat. It's an alright game. 810 at most. Shit game. No, it's a shitty game for idiot waifu bots like you. I wish this waifu equals bad game meme would die. It's a stupid game. Pandering to idiots, what's here to discuss? Are we being raided by normies? M -m normies, fuck off. Fun things are fun. You're not allowed to have fun with video games. I agree, Chad. Can you imagine having fun with video games? Video games are a job. A, prof a serious job for serious people only. Fun is a buzzword. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Lilum receives mysterious messages. Receiving mis Halloween was back in October, but this terrifying tale didn't become popular until now. Reports say that Lilum across the city have been receiving strange transmissions with messages that are confusing at best and threatening at worst. The contents are not clear, as most of the Lilum can't remember exactly what they had heard. But the most mysterious thing of all is that perhaps the fact that the Lilum could not record any of these messages while they were broadcasted. It was almost as if something had blocked the Lilum from doing so. While well, we have nothing but anecdotal proof, even among our own Lilum, the mystery behind these messages is one that we should be paying attention to. Is Kira Mickey the biggest pop idol in history? The world at large is still coming to terms with the idea of the Lilum being so quickly integrated into our society. Some say they can't be treated as human because they are immortal as, and as such cannot really understand what it's like to be alive. But most of Kira, the Kira Mickey fandom would disagree. Anti Lilum people are insane. To me, Mickey knows more about life than I do, and I'm older than this damn city. Richard's show, told 55, told the augmented eye during a fan gathering. I'm with Richard, added Nacho 6. I may be a dog, but I'm utterly fascinated with the ways she writes about things in her blog. She's impressed by everything, and nobody really knows what life's about anyway. Nacho dog? Fun things are fun, I know, right? Quincy studies the possibility of allowing imports. Glitch City is one of the few places on Earth that's strictly self-sufficient, with an import rate of only 0.8%. However, that might change due to the recent shortages across the city. 
Prime Minister Quincy revealed this morning that the government plans to have a more relaxed policy for importers. We won't lift the currency control, but we can provide them foreign currency at a low fixed rate. That way, we can secure essential items at affordable prices, Quincy told AE. Some experts say that private companies are no longer working at full capacity, which is unsurprising news given that the Quincy government has seized most of them, resulting in the shortage of crisis in the first place. Thank you for the head pad and the Gamer Pride Redeem. Still getting used to this collar a bit. I think I've loosened it as much as I could, but sometimes, even though I know it's not choking me, it still feels like... I guess I have to get used to like having this weight at the bottom, bottom of my throat. No TTS Redeem? Cancelled? I mean, I could add one. I've been- I keep saying I'm gonna add sound redeems and then I forget to do that. One of these days, a Tatsugeki redeem is just gonna show up in the options and no one except the most loyal of lollies will notice. And then you're just gonna spam the shit out of it with over 9,000 challenge points saved up. Don't worry, you'll get used to having a collar on. Io. I mean, I think I've loosened it as much as I could. And I could stick more than one finger down my uh, collar, so I know it's not tight. It's just more like the feeling of a weight on my neck. I'm not used to it. I'll get used to it eventually though, I'm sure. But it's a collar, it stays rigid. It not flops down like the plastic thing, rigid. Yeah, and you know what? It's clearly, it's far superior to the other one. And this thing can't really like break all of a sudden like the other ones did. You saved me actually a lot of money with this. And I'm grateful for that. Honestly, uh, I'm just kind of tired right now. Playing Valhalla takes a lot out of me, mainly because I'm talking so much. Like, when I'm reading everything in character. Wow. Things that are built to last and don't damage your skin? No way. I know, right? Imagine using a product that is not only designed with the user in mind, but is built to last and was built by someone who cares about you, does a better job than some over-commercialized piece of crap that you buy several of in the course of a year just to keep breaking after a few months. Except when you pinch yourself with a clip. Yeah, I've, I pinch myself with the clip like every other time that I put it on. But I'm getting used to that too. I call it a love pinch. Buy once, buy Vemtech. I love that slogan. You should, you should totally use that. Ah, <sighs> my mouth is dry. Why is my mouth getting so dry lately? I hope I'm not getting sick. <sighs> you think I need electrolytes? I'll give you something salty. I don't want to take another break after I took one literally 40 minutes ago. 
But I'm honestly feeling really tired right now for some reason. I think what I want to do is play something a little bit action-y. I think we will pause Valhalla for right now and continue it next Monday. Chat. Just because it's tiring to play Valhalla in a different way because of all the talking that's involved and all the, you know, the uh, voice acting and shit. Not that I don't talk a lot when I play other games, but uh, not as much. That, and I do have a tournament coming up this Friday, so I should probably get some practice in, right? That's right. We're playing Guild. I'm going to be pulling up Guilty Memes. Chap. Let me go get my fight stick really quick. You would know about my Uwu stick, wouldn't you? Yeah, that's right. You better laugh. Okay, and I have to plug this back in. I have to remember which one of these damn dumb things actually... All right, now to plug in this chonker, this absolute chonk of a stick. Yep. There you go. Took a little bit. But we are good to go. Okay. 
All right. All right. All right. Fly away now. Fly away now. Fly away. I am also in the voice chat if anyone would like to join me, play some games tonight to end the evening. Oh, for the rest of the evening because I'm starting to fall asleep playing Valhalla and my throat was starting to hurt. Get some practice in. I want to do a few quick matches. So I need to get some practice in on... The tower, and then I'll be open for opening lobbies up. But first off, let's uh, warm up a bit. Mayhem, get it? Mayhem. I made a funny. Hmm. Oh, it's a second too late. What's more with feeling? Oh, that's why. Okay. There we go. Drops it again. Not nearly as much, but... Still works. Almost negligible amounts of damage, actually. That one was 241. Oh. The one with the heavy was... It did have more damage, but not by much. More like by 8 points. Now then, from the other side, shall we? Dropped it again. There we go. Fuck 
fucks it up again. There we go. Let's do a little funny fucky wucky now. Yeah, that's not what I want to do. There we go. I wonder if I can do... Nope. Oh, it's not fast enough, but it still wall breaks him. It just doesn't do as much damage than if I had Orcud. Still. I wonder. So it's like... That was considered a four? What? Weird. That is a mix. I'm trying too hard. It should be... No. I wonder why it keeps doing... That's what you're supposed to. No. But if I were to do, it's actually kind of disgusting. I didn't know you could. I just realized that something is fucky wucky <laughs> with the fucky fucky. Ah, there we go. Much better. Now your <laughs> face is on there. <laughs> Ayo. Ayo, a little, Ayo. A little pixelated. I think I, I need to put on higher resolution at pictures. Ayo. Where? 
You mean to tell me you, a professional fighting game streamer, don't have a fight stick overlay for your stream to let everybody know your exact direct lightning speed inputs? Oh my uh, goodness. Unfortunately, no. I am not yet that sweaty. Bruh. Although I, I must... I need to send you mine because I've already made mine. You made one like that? That's kind of cool. <laughs> right now I'm. I made a I made an eight way overlay with eight uh, attack buttons and two system buttons. That's cool. With an interchangeable uh, face, so you can change the look and color of it. And it runs through a web app in the background, so it's compatible with basically everything straight to OBS. Delectable, scrumptious, if you will. I'm noticing an issue. Um, so. We were talking about how every fight stick has its own quirks and every time you try a new fight stick you'll have to relearn it because in some way it's going to be different from a previous one. Oh my and god. I'm discovering yes. now that I can't seem to be able to go from down dust, uh, the tripping mechanic, to launching an orca. When I try to do it on the uh, TE2+, Plus, it goes not from... it, it goes into an up dolphin, which still works, don't get me wrong, it's just not what I want to do. Makes me wonder if... I guess I could just do that, but that feels kind of cheap. I guess a lot of people do that, where they just spin in a 360 degree motion to try and get to force the stick to do what they want. That's how I use all my supers. I mean, I if it works, it works, right? I don't even grab it with my fingers anymore. I press it down with my palm, kind of like if I was going to grab onto like a gear shifter in a car and i just spin it in a circle until, oh my god uh, the ability goes off <laughs> it's working <laughs> it's actually working <laughs> i just yeah i did i just palm it i guess that's not very different from playing zangief anyway zangief you have to literally spin the controller in a full that's 360 why, degree motion to you to do his moves that's why i like the eight-way uh gate because i can do exactly that i can spin it around and i can spin it spin it spin it all i want and when playing something like Brisket, all of Brisket's moves are uh, half circles and quarter circles. So it's all mm -hmm. just a matter of spinning it in a circle until it goes off. Also, I can definitely confirm that the Ape Do is definitely has slower response. is is definitely not as responsive as a professional fight stick or a professional um, hitbox style controller. Because you can look at this, you can even feel and see from the stream that my aunt my movements are clearly more smooth than they ever were. I guess that's just the difference in quality, really. Hot and Gold Lewis also have 360 inputs in-game. No wonder I can't play them properly. It's like, you can't... I don't know. <laughs> I'm not used to doing 360s, unless I'm panicking. Sorry, do, do 360s with the click box. That's when it's, uh, that's when it gets real. <laughs> Can you do a 360 with the click box? Because I try it with the keyboard and it's really difficult to yeah, do. Yeah, of course. Hmm. It's just different. You just built different. Og. Super. Let's see if we can get a game tonight. If the... If the uh, servers are willing to cooperate. Quick start. Servers? Cooperate? Yeah, man. Uh, don't be silly. Fucking imagine. That will never happen. Ever. Ever. Here comes Daredevil. Here comes the next challenger. Who is playing tonight? It says here that around 2,605 people are playing this evening, so who knows? I'm gonna see if there's any game if I have any gamer friends online as well. I'm online, but I'm invisible. I, oh yep. Yeah. I think we already got our match. Yep, we got a match. Playing I'm against match. a happy chaos. Oh, that's lovely. Let's see how mm -hmm. good they are, chat. Hey yo. My bussy is ready to be busted. Uh level fifty three happy chaos. They are crossplay. So the next version of the click box, the new mounts for the screws are just being finalized and should be finalized in the next hour. Hog. 
I have the pre-version ready, but I'm seeing if I can even further improve it. It's already indestructible. But I want to, I actually want to run it over with a car with 100% confidence that it can take it. And not just like one slowly, I mean you can ram it with a hammer. Gonna be the, the, the fight stick to end all fight sticks. I yell? That's what I want to hear. prove that free, 3D printing technology is superior to injection. Which it is in a whole slew of different ways. I yell? Well, you can't have texture on injection mold. Is injection molded how uh, most plastic stuff are built? Pretty much everything around you is injection molded. Ah, oh, yeah? Like your keyboard, your monitor frames, your 8-bit dough, or 8-bit do. 8-bit do. Everything. Do. Your mouse. Everything is, uh, almost everything is, is injected. The only things that I can think of that are plastic that are not injected but are actually... Um, subtractive, uh, manufactured, uh, uh, never... things like plastic gears inside, like RC cars and things. When I've you see those little white gears, those pass. little Teflon white gears, they're, mm -hmm. uh, they're, they're ground away. But I can't think of anything else that uses that kind of tech. Pretty much everything else is injected. I yell? Ah, this happy chaos finally has a strive. Get it? Strive? Ha ha ha. <laughs> Ear that or he didn't like getting his ass kicked the first round, so now he can finally show his true powers. Very good. Kill your friends. Guilt free. Yeah, who dis? Hello, fanboys. Hey, hey, hey! It is a Scarlet Tempered! How are you doing tonight? I don't think there's any fanboys here. Oh, no, never mind, I see one. Wait, no, I see two. One and a half. Ayo, nice punt, a nice grab. Nice wall pressure you got going on there. However, can you do with this? Oh, he blocked it. Didn't block that though, did you? Get thrown, bitch. Nice burst. Uh oh, can I block it in time? No, I'm in mid. Oh yes, uh, yes I did. Uh, be afraid, happy chaos. Uh-oh. Oh, too bad. That was actually really close. Fuck me. <laughs> this Happy Chaos really wants to not lose a second time. I don't blame him. I remember when... Are you? I still tell people that I hate playing against Happy Chaos the most. But the more I play against him, or maybe it's because Happy Chaos is a little bit more balanced than he was at release, I'm the fear of fighting against big uh, funny gunman is starting to wear off at last. It probably doesn't help that the Happy Chaos means that I'm familiar with are just stupid good at playing Happy Chaos. So, you know, that kind of changes your opinion of things. But it looks like he's going to take this round. Yeah, it's going to kill. Gee, I wonder if it will kill. Very nice. Who will take game three? Yeah, I mean, he's he's a lot better than he was at release. Not that I've played at release. But I've seen the replays. Where he could just it really helps faster. that they pretty much... um, they It really helps that they... Uh, what, what, what did they do? They made his uh, focus thing recover a lot slower. Like, stupidly slower to, compared to release. It used to be dumb in how fast it was. But beyond that, he's still capable as a character. He's just a little bit less busted. I actually saw some people on the Steam forums complaining that he is now apparently too weak and not worth playing. They are asking, un unironically, for him to have a DP. And it's like, what the fuck do you need a DP for? Perfect. Oh, sorry. 
Oh shit, so close to getting a perfect. He is trying really hard. He's like, I do not want this maid to perfect me. Fuck you, May. Fuck you in the ass. I have guns. Guns beat sea life. Nope. Ah, uh, it looks like this is a great start to tonight's ranked games chat. <laughs> I, just, I just perfected a Giovanna player at 1000 MS. The game would be frozen for eight seconds. Then we would get about 20, 25 frames in. Then another eight seconds freeze, 25 frames in. It was quite a match. Quite a match. Wow, that sounds like the match of all time. I'm not going to lie. Don't worry. <laughs> After over a month, they've acknowledged that they think they know what the problem is. Oh, the problem uh, is that Giovanna player was playing on Wi-Fi. <laughs> I really or, know the problem. <laughs> what's your opinion on this uh, fan theory going around that people insist that someone, some hacker man's going around just randomly slowing down games for no reason? Um, I, uh, it was a thing. That, that did happen for a while. That's not what's happening now, though. Yeah, Arxis insists that there's no hacking going on, and honestly... I mean, if it is a hack, it kind of feels like a very particularly weak sauce one because all you're doing is just, oh, okay, you're reducing the frame rate of the game so that it's like playing a PowerPoint presentation, but it's not the worst thing they can do. And, you know, to be fair, maybe it's for the best that they can't do, can't seem to do anything else besides that, so whatever, but I don't know. It sounds more like an annoyance than anything else. Ooh. Damn it. I am celestial mentally, but not in game. Hackerman is preventing me from reaching my peak. Say it ain't so. Is that a, is that a reference, Tokoro? I'm assuming that they're mocking someone, but that I don't know. Is... That is about word for word. If you replace Hacker Man with Kai, that is word for word a tweet that went viral a while ago. Is it now? Yeah, that's what I thought, no girl. D was it on Scrub Crooks or? It may have been, but I just thought circulating around. Did you think I was going to get DP'd, Soul? Think again. I respect the DPs now, which is a total lie. I always get DP'd because I'm dumb like that, but... Nice. <laughs> Y'all never seen that Kai player on Twitter? Uh, no, I don't really follow any Kai mains on Twitter. I could be a dick right now, but I'm going to... I'm going to suppress it. I'm going to suppress the... I'm gonna suppress the desire to make a to make a meme about Kai right now. This soul doesn't want to rem oh there we go. Kill your friends. Kill free. Ow. When he does that move, it sounds like he's saying, come clean. As opposed to being... As opposed to what? Very nice. Should have not tried to grab. That was my bet. Nice burst. Finisher him. Oh, I thought he was going to punish my grab just then, but he did not expect it. He probably thought I was afraid of grabbing him at that point. Perfect. Perfect. I need to get out of the tower. I'm, I'm hurting people. I yeah? Would you're hurting people, or as in, would your connection, or as in beating the people? Oh no, I'm I'm absolutely like chain perfecting people. No shit. <laughs> Get thrown. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, you know what? That was 
I totally set myself up for that DP. Fair enough. I kind of like this back and forth. If people asked what they what is meant by footsies, I would basically just show them a game like this, where the Kai and I are just constantly trying to measure distances with each other. Who can touch the other person first? Oh. Oh shit. You knew I was going to try and grab then, huh? Very nice, very nice. Nice burst. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh my fucking god. I gotta save that replay. That was actually I liked I really liked that back and forth. The the tasting of each other being like who's gonna get who first? Who's gonna just scratch the other person? Just just fucking scratch him. Scratch him and sniff him. Smell the smell of the game. I'll play a couple more ranked games, and then, if you like, I can try and set us up an open lobby. Since we got the gang here. And once again, chat, uh, once we set up an open lobby, as always, y'all are welcome to, more than welcome to join us for some games, for some Guilty Gears. Servers, um, servers allowing, of course. Oh, shit. Nice throw. Oh, shit. Ow. This soul is out for blood now. He's like, fuck you, man. <laughs> he even just throws the vending machine on the ground. Oh, deep bead. Fuck me. <laughs> oh, well, enjoy your 2-1. What a bore. I'll show you a bore later, soul. <laughs> oh, no, I made him rage quit. Io, who are you playing against? Oh, and Angie. We played six really? rounds, four of them were perfect, and he just he just gave up. You know what? I can I can dig it. He 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 did almost get me one round though. You probably just cr this delicious, delicious like do not touch ground knock up thing. It was really nice. Are you? I did have burst the whole time, but I wanted to see how long I can stay up in the air. <laughs> six rounds is a full set, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Uh yeah. I don't think he rage quit. I think it just disconnected he... you guys after. No, no, I mean disconnected, but he didn't even... His character didn't get up. It just vanished. It poofed. Oh, uh, he might have gotten sent to another floor. Maybe. He could have been deranked. <laughs> As a possibility. Can you go lower than floor four, though? Be uh, yeah. I've seen people on floor two. Actually, no, I've been down to floor uh, three. Or two? Was it two or, or three that I started on? I think uh, you started you, on... You started on like four or six, if I recall. Uh, I don't think I started that high. I, I I got to floor like seven in the first like two days, but... Oh, what the then shit? Then I got thrown I... straight back down. I played as Happy Chaos me and Happy Chaos play before, didn't I? I did. This is the first guy I played against this evening. Hey, yo. How did and I get matched with him the second time? 
Uh, no, he's still playing Happy Chaos, but for some reason, Quick Match ran, or matched me with him again. If he loses this next match, he's gonna get downrated. He's gonna get Ooh. he's gonna get kicked down a floor. <laughs> well, I'm fighting a Potemkin, and whoever wins this next match gets a promotion. Awesome. How do I fight a pot? Uh, yeah, no, okay. don't get grabbed. I can, don't, I can don't... fault less. I can fault less. He's a uh, moving wall of death, right? We found that out last time. You can. I guess you could because faultless is faultless. It was on your stream. You found out that you you were able to faultless uh, his ult, and you were like, "Oh my god, why haven't I been doing this all along?" I think that guy left. Either that or your servers are crapping out. Hmm. Well, you could do that, or you can just double jump over it if you have a nice down. If you if you want to, does Bridget have any decent down attack or any decent uh? Air downs. Perfect. Oh, well, so the problem with double jumping or super jumping over it is he can, if they're ready for it, they can heat knuckle you as soon as you jump. Oh my god, it's the same happy chaos. I don't think there's enough people online tonight to play against. That's why it's matched me with Ailey three times now. <laughs> and this guy's like, nah, man, I'm not playing you again. <laughs> I might just have to go ahead and make us a room, guys, because I don't think it's the game's gonna match me with anyone else tonight. Yeah. Fuck it. Uh, I'll go ahead and get out of here and um, make us a room so we can play together. I mean, if y'all are up for it, if you're not, then I'll just keep playing in tower. Or look, keep looking for people to play on tower. Oh, pot hits uh, hard. He touched me twice. I'm on 10% yeah. health. If you want to set oh, up yeah. the menu. Um, All right. All right, uh, I'm gonna connect from consoles, so you can't complain about my. Yay, promo! <laughs> Congratulations on the promotion, uh, Bemboy. What floor are you on? Floor five now? Yep. Pog. All right, let me make a player match. Create room. Create room. Create room. <laughs> Room is three eight three eight seven two zero. I ended up joining that uh, Saint Louis. Uh, that uh, did I just? I ended up joining that um, local Discord server that I mentioned on Twitter the other day, um, under a different account I had that I wasn't using. Oh, I they seem like chill them. people. Room code is up if anyone would like to join. Can't wait to get parts to mod this stick up. The first thing I want to do, I think, is change the uh, art. Ryu is nice and all, but I kind of want to put brisket on there or someone else. Maybe I should put lols on here, huh? <laughs> Okay, just heads up, this is me hopping in right now. No problem. Era regret life. I regret li Oh, steal. Got him. Damn it. <laughs> gonna throw it, get a ball to the face. Uh, go blast it. Hold on. I, I have not played. Ben Boy's getting his pussy busted. Yeah, I finally got. I, I got Potemkin busted and I just fell over. <laughs> <laughs> it takes like 80% of your whole health. Og champ. That's pretty funny. All right. Left or right? I'll take right. <sighs> All right, let's, my let's Lewis do it. is a little rusty. <laughs> Sounds like I'll have to lubricate it. Do you like my new Lewis skin? 
I can't see it. I've got the Alex Yeek colors on right now. Oh. <laughs> well, check out stream in a little hour later, if you so wish. Forget my gold, Lewis. My guilty gear is rusty. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's time to lubricate the gears. Yo. I can't. They're too guilty. Oh, yeah? Oh, I'll show you something to be guilty about. Oh, my God. Lousy, I got kicked out of my floor. Already? They said I was too good and I have to go up higher. Oh, that kind of guilt out. Oh my god, I can't believe that you're getting good at the game. Pretty soon you will be at the proper floor that, that matches your actual skill level, which is 8 or above. Fuck yeah, me, no, I just like, got DP'd by I'll, a gold I'll, Lewis. I'll be back to floor 2 in no time. God damn it. Adam. Nice. <laughs> what the hell is that skin? <laughs> uh, it's a hard to see because they're wearing using a different is, skin is from the, default. Is that but... the bad guy from Sonic? Uh, Yes. It is Dr. Eggman, and not Evo Robotnik, it's a different, it's a different, it's a modern Eggman skin, as opposed Dr. to... Dr. Kintober? Yes. <laughs> as opposed to the uh, previous one, which was the uh, Sonic, Sonic, um, Sonic Rebels uh, version. This is the video game version. Do Dr. Jim Carrey? Yes. You know, I actually heard that the Sonic film wasn't that bad. In fact, I heard it was kind of a, kind of uh, fun, supposedly. It had Jim in it. Of course, it was going to be great. Yeah, and I heard Jim Carrey did a fair job as Doctor Robotnik, all things considered. Considering he's sixty. I mean, is if he you really like animated oh, he's movie? Old, where... He's more than that. He's like sixty-three or something now, isn't he? Sorry, uh, Steel. What are you saying? Animated if, what? If you like buddy film, where a white guy with beard talks to animated character in the seat of his in the in the passenger seat of his truck then it's an all right movie so you're saying if you enjoyed detective pikachu oh, shit, you will enjoy should've... the sonic movie or god hop, damn it or hop or ted or any of those other movies that have that shot for the majority of their movie okay you know what i have never seen any of those movies <laughs> I wanted to watch the Detective Pikachu movies. It looked kind of cool, but I didn't. Nah, if you want to watch a detective movie with Jim Carrey in it, Ace Ventura. That's oh, yeah. The, the old school shit. Oh, yeah. And you got to watch it on VHS and mm -hmm. on a curved screen. I will say I can confirm that the Mario movie was great. I would, I would definitely recommend that to anyone who was a fan of Super Mario Brothers growing up. He's 61. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jim Carrey is 61? Hmm. He's officially retired now, isn't he? He said that Sonic was his last movie ever. Yeah. Does that mean there's not going to be a Sonic 3? There might I mean, be, but it won't have him. Other villains. Villains. That's true. There are a lot of... I mean, they could always draw from the Archie Sonic universe, couldn't they? Ah! No, they should make a... They should make a... The modernized Sonic, where him and the... The, the Black Knuckles have some sort of a... Some sort of a... I don't know. They Starting could, the family yeah. thing. They could do the uh, whole... They could have the... Uh, um, <laughs> unlike Sonic, I don't chuckle. Uh, so can Knuckles rap going on in the, in the background as well? Yes. Oh, shit. I did not mean to do that. I just panic. Imagine panicking. The rust is coming off fairly quick, though. Rub it with a bit of white vinegar. 
Hey, yeah. Probably After this match, WD40. <laughs> After this match, let's go ahead and switch it up. Uh, do you want to fight Venboy or do you want to fight Venboy next or should I fight Venboy next? Ow. 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 Mm. Ow. Nightshade. Mm. Bruh. 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 Ow, shit, fuck, ow, 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 shit, ow, fuck. I fucked up the Gold Lewis combo. Ow, motherfucker. God damn it. Chip, <sighs> did, I get, did I get chip damage or? Uh, were you blocking on wake up? I was holding block on wake up, yeah, but it didn't look like the black animation even started. Ow, oh, fuck my the life. The gun is really good at chip. Uh, you have to faultless it. It's basically I get to take your meter for free is what the gun is. Devious. Delightfully devil is Seymour. Ow. Fuck my life! Oh my god. That's the one thing, that's one of the things that consistently fucks me over. Uh, either if, if not Gold Lewis and Ram, the fucking DP that he got, or say the DP they wake got. Wake up super? The wake up super always I mean, destroys everyone, my asshole. Everyone but Eddie can, or Zato can wake up super. I don't know then, it's always particularly you and Rams that do that to me. It's so with Gold Lewis, his defensive options are really bad, and I'm bad. I'm also bad at Gold Lewis, <laughs> so I just I'm like I know if this hits, it'll save me. So I just do it on panic. I don't know what to do, so I'm just gonna turn invulnerable by using my super. <laughs> exactly. Sounds like a plan, little man. <laughs> I do the same thing sometimes. Man, so I, I forget. My brain needs five seconds to just think about things, so I'm just gonna play this long ass animation. I straight up forget that supers have invulnerability frames, so I never use them for that purpose ever. <laughs> Even though I know that I probably should be, because really? maybe. Yes, really. I always forget that. I don't think of supers as, oh, I can go invulnerable when I use this. I think of them as, how can I use this to kill the player? Right after I, it's I used. I must think of it backwards, because I think of a super as, like, a dispel that can also mess someone up real bad. I mean, that's not a bad way to think of it. That's how a lot of people clearly so use supers, right? That's the first time ever killed how they are in Guilty Gear, but, like, in Street Fighter, there are very few, like, good reversal supers. When they took away invulnerability on Mercy Res, I cried for a whole month. Why did they do that, aside from the fact that Mercy was always, like, a fucking game-changer type character? Oh, uh, refused to res the entire team and become invulnerable during the whole resurrection animation. Oh, Whereas now that's... she reses one person at a time, and oh. uh, she's completely vulnerable and slowed by 90% while doing so. So now she's, like, super mega ultra vulnerable, whereas before you used to be able to, like, pop your res, not to res someone, but to dodge, like, bombs and things. <laughs> no shit. That was the yeah, thing people her, did. Her res is not her in the middle of everything. Anymore. Sorry, what are you saying? Her res no, isn't God her damn it. anymore. Oh my fucking god. Mercy has a completely different ult, and res just became one of her abilities. Bruh. You beat me in a first to three as Gold Lewis. <laughs> Okay, I just looked at the stream and I'm like, Nega Robotnik. You get to fight Vimboy now. Vimboy, get your Vim ass over here. What? You'll never find me. I know you're up on the roof. You were not. What the fuck? We're just fucking materialized out of nowhere. <laughs> oh my There's shit. There's so many hiding spots in your house. I love it. And when you play a thin character like this, you can hide. <laughs> Are you ready? I've been meaning to work on my 
furniture for a little bit in the abyss. I rolled some new ones, but I've been too lazy to do so. Oh, yeah, I've been working on the furniture in, uh, you know, in, 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 in my house, but, uh, well, yeah. yeah. I run a factory here now. Yeah. yeah, I'm I'm rolling for fishing just for soundtracks at this point. I did that for a while, but now the number of things I unlock is close to a crawl, so I think that's the game telling me that it's time to roll other stuff. I don't know how it works, to be honest. Free. Oh. I need... I don't have Big Blast Sonic yet. That's all I need. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised that Elfelt's, um, that Elfelt's Marionette theme is not in the game by default, so I had to mod it, so that's the reason why their mod exists for it. Oh, that's a reach! Although, to be honest, I'm curious how they would balance Elfelt for its drive. There's some people like that character. hate her literally so much that they claim that they'll quit Strive if she ever gets released here, but you know that's not true. Well, we've already got one oppressive gun character. Uh, Biken? What? <laughs> I'm kidding. Happy Chaos. I'm trying to remember. I know Bridget is a bad matchup for me, for God Lewis, but I don't remember the counterplay. You're faster than me. And no, are you getting gold loose? On a lot of things, you're faster than me. Not to mention that reach, boy. The freaking let me just spin the coffin on my back all over the place just that scares the shit out of me. Especially since you could be tricky with it, and be able to, like have the opponent guess, oh, which direction is gonna come from now? Wait, the spinny coffin. Yeah, the Spidia, uh, the uh, like Behemoth Ty Typhoons, Behemoth like Typhoon. Age. Yeah, those things. The fact that you could spin it in all four different corner, in all four corners, like that, or in the up. What? Bruh. How did that? How did that not go through that? Like I set it up for you to jump, and I jumped with you, and it still hit me, bruh. Wait, crap! How do I do the laser? How do I do hmm. funny laser? I forget. Get juggled, boy. Oh my gosh. Oh, who needs a funny laser when you got this mass, this big How ass much DP? Damage? Stupid uh, damage. That was the. I was on more than half health. That was the seven. The it was either the seven twenty or the ten eighty version. That is not. And just think, that's not even his final form of that DP. He could still summon drones to go after you to explode your face after he knocks you in that's the air. A, oh, yeah. That's a clean hit. But you also just, however many times you spin the stick, makes it stronger. Io? It makes it slower and stronger. Oh, wow. I just take out the minigun. <laughs> that fucking rage! Jesus Christ! Get off me! It's hard oh, to I'm tell. Not, I can do things too. It's hard oh, to. Like, oh my there. god. No! Oh, shit! Yes. <laughs> No! <laughs> I remembered laser. It's hard to tell unless you pause the game, but the person that made the skin for uh, Gold Lewis also modeled, um, also actually put Chaos in the game. Chaos actually pops his head out of the uh, coffin during certain moves. Chaos control. Got him! No! It looked like you were going into animation. Damn. Anyway. Ayo, oh, perfect. Perfect! Whoa. Yeah, that's... That's the problem God Lewis what has. What the fuck? We just cancelled each other! What in the world? Clash! I need to, be, like, watch myself so I'm, like, pixel-perfect distance on you. Because I can <laughs> reach past you, but only by, like, a fleece dick. <laughs> A fleas dick, you say? Yep. You would know what a fleas dick size is like. Uh, proportional to its body? Uh, not bad, not bad. Oh my fucking god. Oh, my hero! D, get 
dick pressured. What? He was blocked. You, 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 you mad? <laughs> oh my fucking uh, god. Well, now, now I'm just waiting for you guys to quit falling Dude. for that. Now you're not falling for it. So stop doing it. Me? Oh, lulz, stop falling for- stop lulz, respecting the DP and not getting double penetrated? Since when? I blocked that reversal. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Bloody hell, mate. Kill your friends. Guilt free. Oh. <laughs> 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 it happened live! You actually Reverse. did it! You actually managed to do an air rock to baby! <laughs> oh my fuck! There's no shot. Oh my god. We need to re we need to restart the counter. Days uh. Days since Vemboy managed to last land a rock to baby. Drone. Ow. Ooh. Ooh. Panic. Too much panic. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh shit. I oh. have very little bar. Oh, he hit my yo-yo. <laughs> yeah, he punched the yo-yo. Or yeah. Damn. I just, I just realized yeah, it that. Doesn't matter. It was worth. It was worth the, uh, the grab. <laughs> I just now realized that the Gold Lewis's name has been renamed to Egghead Lewis. Apparently. Oh my god, I'm getting bones, boy! Oh shit. Damn, son. I told no, you. I'm about you... to get uh, probed. I am. You'd like that, wouldn't you? What in tarnation? Is that lies and slander? Mm -hmm. No slander, only love. Push the stick that pushes. Hey, 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 hey. And feel your... Kill your friends. Guilt free. Yeah, I don't know. You would think that a game like Strive would tucker me out faster than playing a visual novel like Valhalla, but right now I honestly feel a lot better. What it might be is because I get super invested into narrative-based games, and I love them a lot, right? But I feel like I have to invest more attention into them in some ways, so they feel like they get more tiring to me than, say, oh, I can do that too. playing a fighting game. And why I don't know that why that is. <laughs> why is that a blue cancel and not a gold one? I'll show you a blue, blue cancel. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. oh right. shit. The oppression is real. Ah, oh, no, I did. Uh... Point me at your enemies. Didn't come out. Damn. <coughs> That is not the typhoon I wanted. Oh shit. Oh, crack, 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 crack. I did oh shit. One. It didn't my input didn't come out. There goes all of your health. Have a double. Mac double on the house. Oh man. Oh, oh it's delightful. Too much too much effort. Too much sweat. <laughs> what rematch? How many matches is it on? It's on infinite, isn't it? No, it's, it's first three. three. First oh, three, two yeah. Two. Oh. I always have my room set up to tournament to a uh, VTuber tournament rules. Out of habit. Oh! 
Oh, you like that? Uh oh, shit. That's not the typhoon I want. Oh, shit. Get back. What? Oh, wait, whoa, who wa- oh. How did it hit me? What did it even hit? <laughs> I'm confusion. Ow. Oh, okay. Are you? DP'd? The exchanging of the DPs never stops. No, bad. Bad! Naughty. Ooh, boy. Nice combo with wall break. Oh, Funny shit, laser. He's about to get lasered. <laughs> no escape from the laser. Fuck. Looks like he got Wario'd. Didn't, didn't, didn't come out. Yes, hello, pizza? Hi. I didn't order any mushy, pizza. Mushy, mushy. mushy. Danger day, sir. Hi, <laughs> uh, shall I fight Vembosi next, or do you want to fight against Steel? No, I'll go ahead and spectate. Okay. <laughs> Left or right? Oh, you want to go then? Cool. Yeah, that makes no diff. Let's do it. Are you ready? Let's fight like gentlemen. Mental gen. Do 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 I joined, but unfortunately, you're finally getting tired. Oh, no problem. <laughs> Thank you very much for coming to visit the stream, as usual. And I will see you again on Wednesday. Oh, shit. I will never respect a DP. And I'll see you again on Wednesday, probably. Or on Friday, since you joined up in a tournament also. Up! Get off me. Get off me. Oh, shit. God damn it. No. What? I don't you think just, so. Like, slid from it. Mm hmm. Bruh, you blocked my slide? It was an insta block. Ah! I will not fall for your. God damn it. <laughs> my antics. <laughs> Y'all are getting too good for me now. Ow. Shit, fucking. Oh, I just cancelled into a scooter and you caught mm. me out of it. Ow, damn it. Oh, okay. Nope. Oh, oh you bursted. I say, I say, my I say no. Red. You don't want me to finish this. I say, oh, god damn it, Vim boy. Oh my god. Hey, butt. Shit. Keep your dolphin. Wow, I really felt sore from that one. Oh, that was a victory well earned. Point me at your enemies. Bruh. Oh, that was quick. Yeah, that was good. Ow. Out. Stay in the corner. Stay in the corner. That's your in invuln frame, as Damn requested. Invul in God, I'm trying to say a witty comment. Damn it. Okay, fine. Oh, oh, wow. Clean. Wow. Okay, I see how it is. Get get off me for fuck's sake. Oh, get uh, your enemies. Uh -huh. 
Oof. I can cancel in time. Uh oh! Thanks for eating up my tension. Bongo's bursted. Am I right? Ow. 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 Shit. Ow. Ow. Shit. Ow. Ow. Shit. Ow. Was that an over? God damn it. How did that miss? Well, fuck my mid. life. That would have been cool I could have come back from that, but it was not meant to be. I can't believe I'm really, going zero really two. Really laggy rollback there. You're like chunked. No, it says right now that the rollback frames are three. Oh, they're back up to six. Oh, okay. Bro, what the, bro, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> I don't know what that was about. I honestly don't know what that was about. Oh. Interrupted, uh... Bruh. You interrupted Rog. Bruh. Bruh. Let me out! Damn it! Vimboy? Oh my god. Kill your friends. Kill free. Oh my god. You don't get to play the game! Yeah, I don't. Oh my god. This is the worst loss I've ever had against you, and I was actually not fucking around either. Bruh. Uh, just, just, bruh. No, I'm calling it now. Both I of you have I'm, finally have come. But both of you have like finally completely surpassed me in skill. I'm I'm oh. I'm honestly mildly Why? upset now, but that's all right. That just no, means I have I to have get the good. I have the superior I, I, controller. I'm running a TE2+. <laughs> yep, and I'm running I can, the I can't, tech click box. I can't, blame it, I can't blame the controller now. <laughs> I need to get no. good. Click box superior. We actually got 8 minutes left of stream, but we, so we should be able to get a few more, like a couple more games back in, or in before the end of the stream. Who am I playing against What's next? Ventic uh, superiority. I have eight minutes to redeem myself for getting going two and three and zero and three <laughs> against for two. Some of you guys, controllers are fancy and all, but have you considered PlayStation controller uh, not using the D-pad? At the convention, I tried using a PlayStation controller, and I did so shit, even against total noobs, that I I'm, I was embarrassed. I was like, "Yeah, fuck it, I'm going I'm going back home, and I'm getting my controller." <laughs> Well, I started with a Nintendo Pro Switch controller, and I was actually not using the D-pad either. I was using the, the left stick. Oh my god, Dr. Eggman's music is actually playing in the background. I love this mod so much. God. But the Kiss of Death is like the best song in the soundtrack. 
the egg man i think this is the uh jonathan young version of the song too or something it sounds familiar it's the rock version then the egg man god damn it and you fuck the you and your minigun put down the feel out <laughs> Glad I'm having these practice sessions before Friday. Fuck me, man. You know what I'm gonna say now, right, fanboy? Mm -hmm. Oh you shit! Know, I you know, fucked up my typhoon. Oh, but I caught it with the cross. <laughs> <sighs> what are you gonna say? I was gonna say you should join the VTuber fighting game tournament this Friday. Never. This drive tournament. Kill your friends. I am too busy building fight sticks. Fair enough. No, not really. I should, it should be okay. What are the entry costs? There is no entry costs. What All you have to do. Prize. There is no prize except for the uh, glory of having beaten several pro fighting game players, some of whom have actually been to Evo, who happen to what be VTubers. Huh? What is an Evo? Evo is. It's the, the biggest fighting game convention in the world. In the world. Oh, okay. Sure, what I know. Mm hmm. I actually would like to visit, go to Evo next year, even if I like lose. No, the, where was like, my? Even if I like get knocked out the first bracket, just going there is an experience in itself. Uh, don't they do placements online? Uh, you know, I actually don't know because it's also it's a convention and a tournament, right? So you don't need to like actually participate in the fighting itself to go there. There's even a few people, there's actually even a few VTubers who went there and like blogged about their experiences being VTuber visiting going to Evo on Twitter and on Twitch and whatnot, but um... Oh shit, see. My, my macros are all fucked up on this system. Takuro says, I'm gonna go to Evo but only for the multi side turning. Hog. Yo, we're gonna meet in the bathroom, Dokuro? Sounds like it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, it never misses. Just punching me out of her attacks. Oh, god damn it. Will it kill? Yeah, fuck. I... <laughs> My Roman War... cancel macro isn't set up for some reason. The crow says they were born in the bathrooms molded by it and their war... Oh my fucking god, you play Warichio? Yeah, I imagine you would be sick. I play Vermilion myself. Kill your friends. Kill free. Hi. I play Overwatch. I'll show you an Overwatch. God damn it. I play Dota too. Fuck, I can't... <laughs> I can't Roman cancel without my macro. Oh, shh. Isn't Roman just th any three buttons? Yep. Yeah, but that's hard to do on a PS4 controller with one hand. That's not true. you're playing with a claw grip. I'm not playing with a claw grip because I'm using the shoulder buttons. Oh. Well, can't you use a shoulder and, like, just mush your thumb down? on two other buttons? No, because, um, burst or dust doesn't count. Oh. Uh, I did not base my entire VTuber design almost exclusively on War Reiki for nothing. Bruh. <laughs> that's, that's actually kind of pog, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> ah. You know, Ventahack, when I first met Ventahack as a VTuber, he actually wasn't a VTuber yet. He was just a regular uh, fighting game streamer. But when he decided to become a VTuber, he decided to base his character off of Happy Chaos. And it's like blatantly obvious. Ah, fuck. Ugh. <sighs> 
Oh man, I'm gonna have I to... just I just went on Twitch and I was like, all right, who's the biggest? Who makes most money? I'm just gonna clone them and uh, make the big bucks. Yeah. So I, I I went to search VTuber tag by uh, by the numbers, by the viewers, by mm -hmm. the subscriptions, and I found someone called the, the tungsten rat or some shit, and I was What's just that? like, all right, just copy pasted this shit, and she'll be right. I've Hold never on. heard of I'm about to keep playing. I just gotta cha I gotta fix my controls. Yeah, sure. Take your time. Let me cancel all this fast. Um, okay. I oh wonder my god, if... I broke the rules. I talked about other VTubers on the stream. Oh no. Oh no, I'm getting banned. Yeah. Real talk, I actually don't care that much about if other pe people talk about other VTubers on stream as long as they're not trying to ro rope me into drama or some shit. Oh my god, well, that's why it's drama. That's why it's usually a role. It's either drama or comparisons or yeah. pestering for a collab. I mean, I figure like that's the reason for my rules. I try. I don't. Plus, Vimbo, you're not you're not in chat. You're on stream, so that rule doesn't apply. Oh. <laughs> well, crap. Steel actually has a point. In that in in that case, uh, you wanna you wanna do a. 12 week long, uh, three times a week satisfactory uh, collab with me. And every time we're going to do a half an hour segment, shilling my uh, gaming hardware. Mm -hmm, Possibly. 5% mm -hmm. five, five discount uh, checkout. Just enter code LOL's bottom. <laughs> no, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Now my Roman cancels are working. That's, that's my favorite part. I'm actually going to do that. We should go ahead and just clip that off the stream. Use that as your advertisement copy. Yep. As life. I'm pretty sure the Etsy still has yeah. a uh, enter code thing at checkout. Oh, yeah? I, I'm oh. going to add it. Anybody who gets the obscure references gets their uh, discount runies. Damn it! So close to getting perfect. Oh well. Uh. That time not getting the typhoon I wanted saved me. <laughs> sometimes the sometimes fuck seeming fuck ups just win you the game, and you got to respect the power of RNG Jesus. Well, Actually, that's, um, that's uh, Brian F, the Street Fighter streamer. That's his story, is he's won multiple tournaments off a of misinput. I forgot who it was that was talking about this, either Sejin or... It was probably Sejin. Um, but he was saying how a lot of people seem to place over overemphasize the importance of combos, and a lot of pro players um, actually misinput more often than they were willing to admit. And sometimes they'd win some games and they just don't they don't say shit because they're embarrassed to admit that, oh, technically I won because I got luck luck unlucky in the right way. <laughs> but you know what? Fair enough. Shit that shit just happens sometimes. Well that's um that's the thing with musicians, right? If you fuck up on stage, that's the song now. That's true. I mean, it's like I guess it's true of pretty much any performing arts where the only one that really knows that you fucked up most of the time, especially in like theater and shit is either the people who wrote the play and shit or the people the uh stage directors or whatever the fuck the audience most of the time doesn't realize that you fucked up and if you play it off well enough they don't need to know it just becomes part of the show i mean that's kind of like the secret to a lot of good clips it's really just stuff that was unplanned that ended up being funny It's called an American Reset, and if it works, it works. <laughs> uh, I will remember this, the crew. What's up? Ow. Yo, is that grounded based footsies? Mm hmm. Oh, 
or it could have been me trying to bait you into getting hit by the one uh, mid-range combo that I actually know how to do properly, or to at least do half of. Fucking drones. There's a lot of uh, mid-tier YouTube personalities that apparently either live in the Midwest or live in Texas and just like live, just don't mind driving up here because when I was at the convention, I got to meet, I got to see Jonathan Young perform live, and that was really cool. And he's actually a pretty cool person in person. I met um, Caleb Hiles last year, and he was here. He was here at the convention this year as well. This year again as well. Really nice guy. Ow. Damn it, that move doesn't work on you because the timings are all. God damn it. Yeah. Well, it's time to go back to the drawing board. It looks like I'll need to learn more than one wall combo. I can't just use the one that you use for all the average size people. Oh shit! Funny laser saved me. Fucking laser. Who okay, won? I'll... No, my god! <laughs> <coughs> oh my fucking god. Ain't no way. Well, it was caught in the stream. Oh, shit. Fuck. God damn it. Will it kill? Oh, uh, yes, it did. When in doubt, spin the analog stick 1080 degrees. I'll spin your stick. Ayo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Match point right here, chap. God damn it. How did I not grab you? What the fuck? Ah, uh, that was meaty. Oh my god. We need to keep track of how many times Lois is going to get caught by Lewis's DP. Gold burst, you know what that means. Oh my god. Oh fuck off, I held DP. Eh, whatever. GG's. How do they always run away so fast? Wait, no? No, because I had to quit out to change my controls. Oh. So I thought you actually... were... No, it's like 3 and 5 right now. I thought you were winning... Yeah, I was going to say, I thought you were winning 3 to 1 in this uh, set. Nah. No, the last set was 1 and 2, and then I had to change my controls. Mm -hmm. Bruh. Add one to the counter. <sighs> that is not the move I meant to use. Damn it. Ow. 
Ow. Nice. That's not what I wanted to do, but it still worked anyway. Go ahead and mark me down for an Amiric for the American reset. I was trying to use Orca. You okay? Yeah. Uh, GG's. <laughs> Fuck me, though. The tryharding is real on my part. Oh, well. Good practice for Friday when I'm really going to get my bussies busted, depending on uh, who Serena sets me up again first. Got a lot of new blood coming in, though, so maybe some of them will be closer to my level. Then, boy, let's play. Last game of the night. Then me? I mean, also, that last... That last interaction, Orca, was objectively the wrong move. It was it really now. Yeah, you don't orca the drone, because it's got a bunch of hitboxes, so it'll just catch you. Oh. you did, I can't just orca over the drone? I mean, you could, but I also... If you orca'd over it, I would have time to react as well. Mm, that's true. Okay, I think I'm going to tap out for real. I'm closing my eyes in front of the computer. See ya. Have a good night, Dakuro. Thanks for coming. Let's do it. So I was working the next prototype for the screws for the mm. clink box. No problem. I made a tiny little alteration trying to make it even stronger. Like I said, I will run this thing over with a car and it will survive. <laughs> Although I think it's way past that point already. I just want to make sure that it's, you know, if someone wants to get stupid with it and just be like, I want to open it, see what's inside. Uh, they, they don't break it. No matter what, no matter how stupid they are. Or, or heavy-handed. You could fill it with scorpions. No, it's full of lead, so if you open it, you're already going to poison yourself. Yeah, but why why get lead poisoning when you could get scorpion poisoning? Reset the oh, counter. No, I've been bitten by a scorpion before. It's not that scary. You've I mean, been was it a big scorpion like... or a little scorpion? A little one. Those are the dangerous ones. He was a young one. That's why he was little. Bitten or yeah, stung? But... Oh, oh stung. yeah, that's the other thing. Not pinched, yeah, stung. Oh. Huh. Yeah, because if you to, get... I used to work in a very, very, very large pet store. And we had a lot of scorpions, and I once got one in the forum. I, 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 assume, I assume any scorpion at a pet store is going to be a non-venomous one. Oh, it was venomous. Just not lethal. It was, like, it was a class 3 licensed scorpion, so it was like, like, ah, you fucking hurts, kill me, sort of thing, but you're not going to die. Yeah, it's, it. it's not like one of the neurotoxin ones. No, 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 it's not going to kill you. This wasn't the killy type. I'm, I wasn't allowed to touch the killy type ones. They're in a double cage with like four locks on them, and we only had two people that were allowed to even touch them. Are you? Friends, guilt free. Damn it. Them boy. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but it was unpleasant. Ah, shit. Oh, smooth. Fucking mm. god damn it, Them boy. <laughs> oh, I almost got the double. <laughs> are you open? You are open. Mwah. I try to. Dump back instead of holding FD. I'm fucking dumb. This is bragging. You're already in block, but yeah, you, you did what I do, which is dump, do Pat. something rather than nothing. Yeah. Oh damn. Okay. 
I believe the fighting game, some fighting game community people call, refer to that as being a, not wanting to push buttons or something. It's like an actual phrase that they use. They're like, if your if your opponent li does not like to push buttons, do this, or if they like push if they like pushing buttons, do this. Yeah, pushing buttons is do they try and how defensive do they play? Yeah. Bloody hell. You interrupted three different of my supers. It's usually with back. like um like strike, oh, throw, my... strike throw players like uh like Kyer or Potemkin. Mm hmm um, Oh okay. I didn't think that was gonna hit me, but alright. If I could do some real cheeky bugger things there and just <laughs> wasn't <laughs> getting the work, you weren't naming any of it. Yeah, I was like, let me just do this like a long ass setup. <laughs> I'm in my try hard mode right now, so you know. Oh, is that what this is? Yeah, I'm I'm try harding right now. Okay, well let, let's slow things down then. I mean, I wasn't kidding when I said I was a little bit miffed that I lost as badly as I did against both of you just Whoa, like a few cool. sessions ago. So you I'm have a actually winning record against me. In... This I, tonight. I mean, do I? Yeah, because that last set was uh, three and five, mm. your favor. I guess, but I don't count the one where your macros are fucked up because that was an unfair advantage. I mean, even if no. you don't count that, you, we went, we went three two and two three. Mm. If you don't count those other matches, I suppose. Whoa, that was my infamously infamous uh, cannonball into a scooter. And it uh, you somehow defended against it. And I I won't claim to be good at God Lewis, but no! God Lewis is probably my it. best character besides Kai. I you? You've grown that much in God Lewis in such a short span of time? I mean, I'm not good at very many characters. The only character maybe in the running are Eno and Ramlethal, <laughs> and I'm not good at either of them. I was going to say, I always feared your Kai more than your Gold Lewis personally, but now I think I might have to reevaluate. Well, Kai is... I don't know if we've played since I got the floor 8 as Kai. Scooter cancel scooter! Oh my god. <laughs> I could tell it's that. It's so confusing because it's like, what the fuck are you doing? The more frustrated I get, the more difficult I'm finding it to perform the Orca because I'm not do I'm not performing the inputs like carefully. I'm like oh. trying to rush them and it's it's starting to bite me in the ass. You see, th that's oh, the thing that with spinning nice. the stick. Spinning the stick is a great like if if anything if all else fails but it does fail from the time to time especially if you really if especially if you don't do it a full 360 where it oh, hits okay. all the switches and you like do it part way there we go well, Fi even... i finally got that out properly hmm? as long as you don't hit the the up one you just have to hit them in order yeah like i have gotten pretty decent muscle memory at this point of doing Orca and um, the Pink Whale consistently, but I'm also I also oh. did on the Ipito ah. on a much heavier spring, so I'm trying oh to relearn gosh. that. On what the? F now wait, is is Orca two quarter circles or a half circle? Orca is half circle forward. Okay. Pink yeah. Whale is two quarter circles. Yeah, then Orca you can spin the stick to get. Yeah. Didn't get to play game that last round. That was that was my problem with Ram. Is her reversal is two quarter circles forward, but if you only do one quarter circle or it only reads one, you throw your sword. So every so often you'll see a Ram just die because they throw their sword. It's like they roll a two quarter sword, get a nat a nat one, and then they proceed to die.
So, um, that's where we're going to end it tonight, chat. Thank you very much to everyone who came for the subs, for the follows. We reached 501. Remember that um, I am open for suggestions for what you, how you all think I should celebrate my 500th uh, follower on Twitch. I am open to most everything. Feel free to, since we're ending, obviously you can't just drop it in the Twitch chat. So feel free to post it to either DM me on Twitter or on Discord or to post it anywhere in the chat in Discord. And we'll collect those and make a poll for them. Oh, I know. We should mm -hmm. play, uh, do a playthrough of Ticket and build our own Minecraft RTX graphics card. Bruh. Uh, we should play um, Ultra Fight Dark Yanta. Could do that too. <laughs> so yeah, um, thank you everyone for coming tonight. And we'll go ahead and find someone to raid. And thank you especially to my wonderful mods, uh, Vemboy and Scarlet Tempered, for playing video with me to this evening. I'm glad that video. the servers did not fuck up this time. So thank you also to Arxis for gradually unfucking things on Strive. And also thank you to the a uh, random ebay seller who sold me this fight stick for 200 bucks i tried to get it down to 190 and they were basically like look it said 200 i'm already giving you a discount take it or leave it and i'm like okay sorry i didn't mean to offend you or anything because this is in a lot better condition than i thought it would be i thought it would be a lot more dinged up or damaged or some shit because some of the fucking I'm kind of upset with the way people treat these things on eBay. It's There's a lot of them that look like they've just been pulled out of a junkyard or some shit like that. But, you know, I guess that's how eBay, how used items are. Let's go find someone to raid tonight. Uh, do y'all have any suggestions before I look through my VTuber friends? No suggestions. Yeah, a lot of people on tonight. Nyanlothotep is playing Valheim. Uh, Chroma is doing Death Stranding. Chroma is doing Death Stranding. Let's go! Gondola Gaming is Capricate playing... Capricate is drawing fanboys with, with a game controller. Let's go! They're doing what? They're drawing a fanboy gamer. What the fuck? What's their name? Capricant. I don't know how to spell that. C-A-P... Oh, R Cap I I C A N T. Capri Cant or Capri Mint? Capri Cant. Okay. Uh, Demon VTuber. Demon VTuber. Oh, they're a Twitch partner. Yes, yes, yes. Interesting. They're Kazi's interesting. friend. Oh, they're adorable. And look at that tummy, Femboy tummy. Yes, <laughs> this is this is delicious chat. We will raid this person to this evening. All right, then. His name's Cole. Everyone likes to call him by his real name because oh, yeah. uh, it's cute. That's a bitching real name, I'm not going to lie. And he's a, he looks like a fanboy, but he's not. He's, a, he's, he's an imposter. I'm breaking immersion. I'm calling it out. It's an imposter. We're going to be doing fanboy raid this evening for our raid message. Thank you everyone for coming tonight and I'll see y'all on Wednesday. Oh, the smell of the